Hey everyone, this is Mike from Galaxy S4 Soft Modder, and today I'll be showing you how to install the exposed framework onto your GS4. The exposed framework was developed by uh, Rovo89 from XDA, and it lets you make low level system tweaks by installing these things called modules. So you can have all the tweaks and features of a custom ROM uh, without even having to install one. So first off, you need a rooted Galaxy S4. If you have the AT&T version uh, with MF3 firmware, you can check out my guide at Galaxy S4 Soft Modder. Otherwise, there are guides on XDA and other Android forms that you can use. Uh, second, make sure to back things up. Uh, if you have a custom recovery like Clockwork Mod or TWRP, you should make a full Android backup. If you don't, you should at least back up your apps and system data with something like a Titanium Backup. Uh, next, you need to enable unknown sources. So to do that, just go to your GS4 settings. Uh, under more. Uh, security. And under device administration, uh, let's make sure this box by unknown sources is checked. And uh, that will allow us to install apps from outside the Google Play Store. So now let's download the exposed installer. Uh, you can check out the link in the full tutorial or go to Rovo89's XDA thread and you should see a download link that says uh, latest.apk. Right, that one right there. So go ahead and install it. And if this doesn't pop up right away, uh, you should have a notification. Uh, you can just tap that notification. And then go ahead, um, tap install. Right, once it's installed, go ahead and uh, open it up. And uh, now we're going to install the actual framework. So tap on framework and install slash update. A super user request should pop up. So go ahead and grant it access. And as you can see, it says uh, changes will become active on reboot. So um, rebooting is something that you have to do a lot with Exposed. Uh, every time you update Exposed, uh, install an Exposed module, or make a change within a module, you have to reboot for the changes to take effect. So Exposed makes it easier by including a reboot button right in the app. So let's go ahead and use it. And let's wait for it to reboot. So once your phone is booted up, uh, it'll have the exposed framework on it, and you can now install modules. Uh, the framework itself doesn't do anything. You have to install modules to actually tweak and customize your phone. Uh, you can check out our full tutorial. I got a link to an XDA thread full of them. Uh, but I'll go ahead and show you how to install and activate a module. Uh, as an example, I'll be using uh, Wanum's Exposed. Um, Going to head to the Play Store. Uh, it's a great starter pack module to have. It has dozens of customizations. Uh, you can easily install it from the Google Play Store, so uh, no need to sideload the APK. So I'm going to go ahead and install it. And once Exposed uh, detects a module being installed, uh, it'll give you a notification that uh, it's not activated yet. So you can either tap notification or from Exposed uh, main menu. Uh, click on modules and to activate it all you have to do is 
tap the chat box and then you have to reboot So once you're rebooted uh, you can go ahead and open up the module and it'll ask you for super, for super user access go ahead and grant it And you can go ahead and uh, check out all the tweaks and customizations that uh, whatever your module offers. So, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And check out the full tutorial at Galaxy S4 Softmodder.